close are we to war, do you think? Well, uh, we're not close to military war, uh, but as I've said before, sanctions target ordinary citizens, or civilians, people who need medicine, people who need special uh, treatment. Iran is pushing back, crippled by harsher new American sanctions after the U.S. walked away from the nuclear deal. Iran now increasing its uranium enrichment beyond the previous limits, not enough for a nuclear weapon. Mohammad Javad Zarif was one of the architects of that original deal. Are you afraid that you're playing with fire here? Uh, I think the United States is playing with fire. We have an agreement, uh, and that agreement includes remedies once one side of the agreement starts violating it. So under those circumstances, you're free to do whatever? Is that your interpretation? Not whatever, but we, we, we're free to start partial implementation. Can you reverse this? Of course, it can be reversed within hours. We are not about to develop nuclear weapons. Had we wanted to develop nuclear weapons, we would have been able to do it a long time ago. Obviously, we would not be targeting a Japanese tanker while the Japanese prime minister uh, was meeting with our leader. Uh, those pictures that the U.S. Navy put out don't prove anything. First of all, uh, we were involved, our Navy was involved in uh, rescue operations around the ships. Why do you think the president took his finger off the trigger, called off a retaliatory airstrike? I think you need to ask him. My analysis is that prudence prevailed. People came to the conclusion that this will not be a limited operation. I take an opportunity to find some way to take the air out of this standoff. Because once you start accepting illegal demands, there's no end to it. Zarif says if the Trump administration were to lift sanctions it has imposed, then room for negotiation is wide open. Is there a face-saving offer that Iran would accept? I think uh, in any uh, negotiation, you need to find a win-win situation. Otherwise, you'll end up with a lose-lose situation.